Hello everyone, welcome to the second tutorial of the music player uh, app and here we have created a lot of like we have done a lot of work in the first tutorial uh, where we have the MVVM, we have the code to fetch the music and we have the code to like the layouts and all that. So let's just now what we are going to do is we are going to create a music player. Now here is the thing. The reason why I'm creating a separate class so that we can you know uh, independent of the fragments we can use this like if there is one fragment and we are instantiating our uh, or initializing our music player then if we go to next fragment or next view then we have to initialize the player again but we don't want that right we want one time initialization for the whole app of the music player so no matter what view or what fra fragment we go to the music player is running right so and can be controlled from anywhere though i'm not using any kind of uh, any kind of other fragments i'm just using one fragment but you will see the view manipulation that i have done so yeah so let's uh, just get right into creating the code for our music player manager media player on complete listener on completion listener so that we can do later now here private var media player media player now private var is paused boolean false well context my application instance var song name string and private var media player listener is equal to media player listener which we will create so first and foremost let's just create this listener so th it it just goes away the error you know and the error we don't need okay so that is gone right and here we can just type a code media player listener is not null and on song completion method is done so this is something that we will do to you know automatically switch the song and also set the listener here set media like once the song finishes it it knows that media player has like completed so how about we just move to another song automatically so this is the code that like uh, like won't do like much so real work we have to begin now okay so let's just create a function that plays our song and this is like the reusable and clean approach that we have taken by creating a separate class play pause image view text view artist name text view album art image view so let's just import all these and this is the cleanest approach that one play song code can be used anywhere if media player is not null then initialize the media player media player set data source so song we have from here and data from here and if you recall in the model we have 
data and in the repository we have the song data here so pretty simple okay media player not null prepare media player start else media player reset and i think the same thing we will be writing here okay is paused false when we are playing the song song name song title an artist name text song dot artist okay and media player if the song is like playing and like it is finishing so then like it should automatically start the new song okay and while for the image i know it is not making sense but it will once like the app runs it will make sense album art set image uri uri update play pause button ui play pause animate song name scroll tv so these two functions we have to create okay now let's see play song pause song play pause is image view so when the song is paused then we have to write the uh, then we have to show the pause button right if media player is playing and like we pause it if we pause it then what needs to happen is is paused true update play pause and obviously we will write the we will link the image view in the song list fragment so right now we are just adding the views and we will attach the values to those views in the fragment right so if the song is playing resume song resume song okay so here if is if is pause true then media player starts and is paused become false and here again we will just update the view fun is playing boolean return media player is playing if it's playing then it's true if it's not playing then it's false okay now we will write method to release media player like once the user exits the app uh, to stop the memory leakages and like uh, like uh, releasing the load from the mobile's processor we have to release the media player okay and now here we'll simply update the ui so 
play pause button if it's playing if playing then pause which is this I don't know if it's visible or not this white color pause if it's not playing then play button okay and this is simply like we want to we want the song to be like uh, song title to be scrolling like mm. so that is why it's just a simple code that I'm, I'm just getting from my whole project I don't feel like it's uh, I should be writing this like a lot of code by myself So what this does is this just makes the text to like uh, animate okay and now what we have to do is we have to do some other things as well that was for song like uh, button and like all that get current position of the song return media player current position to long this is for the progress bar you know seek to value long value dot int okay get duration Okay, mm. return media player not null duration too long and also set volume. So this is like the left right volume. Oh wow. So the left and right volumes that is done and okay with this our media player class is complete and I think we should uh, go to the adapter I think and then after that we can you know work on okay so adapter code I really wanna like copy paste but I will just uh, avoid um, yeah okay let's just create a song holder as well uh, this one I can copy paste just a little code So these are just the views you know that we want to display so there is nothing much that you need to know the views of the list like list views like where we are displaying the song so that is why I thought it's just best to copy them and obviously we need an interface to click on the song itself right we need it like so to be able to handle the clicks on it we, we have we have created like this interface okay and here obviously we will uh, add that this returns the layout for the song list item let's just create song list list of songs and the interface as well private var on song item listener on song item clicked null return song list dot size okay and we need some 
set listener method as well so I will just get these from my previous project and I'll tell you this is for setting the song list this is for setting the listener and this is for getting the items position okay so this is nothing much and lastly in the adapter I'll just get the code and let you know what that was because I really want to prepare myself to write a lot of code in the song list fragment so I do not want to waste my energy here okay yeah so let me tell you what I've done simple I've set the list uh, list like title of the song on the on the view artist name and the image if there is no image then we want it to have like the album art and if there is an image then we we want to have the image view and now here we are creating the like the duration of the time of the song uh, that it needs to have so okay and this is like giving me uh, some sort of error and I need to know why song duration okay I'm going to the model okay this should be fine if we go here gone okay so our adapter is done and now what I will do is I will the only code that I have to write is is in the song list fragment so I think I'll see you in the next one